Jimmy, good morning. How's it going? How are you? Just woke up. Why do I keep hearing my voice? I'm... I'm rather annoyed by today for two reasons. One, my bank account is empty. Second, uh, the battery of my phone is almost dead and I doubt I'll be able to follow, follow um, the stream chat for way too long today because even though I'm charging it, it doesn't charge fast enough and I will eventually run out of battery in less than uh, 30 to 40 minutes. Your hike got cancelled cancelled because of the rain. Oh, it's raining here as well. Mine too. I was supposed to <laughs> hike to the grocery store. And I didn't. Also, I found a very new, um, a very interesting new shop that I want to look into later on. Even though the shop is rather pricey. But I like the products. We will talk about this later. Not on stream. <laughs> because of reasons. Anywho... I kind of forgot what we were doing last time because I was extremely sleepy. I had a headache. I still have a headache. But hey, I want to play video games. Alright, oh, last time we met with this guy who is supposed to be Bibi's father. He got murdered by someone, somewhere. <clears throat> I, I was watching the VOD because I think I missed out in the story. Bits of the story were lost forever from my mind. So I'm thinking that, uh, I don't know, someone died and he had to take the baby and run and uh, someone was, was not okay with that. We don't have the, the full package of the stories just yet with what's going on um, in Bibi's brain with the memories and all that stuff. We, we know that we keep meeting him during um, the World War, uh, War sequences. So far we've seen first and the second. So I don't know what's coming up next. Take the baby and run. <laughs> So what's up, Jimmy? How are you? I wanna do things, I wanna deliver. I've been reading forums without uh, getting any spoilers in the meantime. It was, it was, it was extremely hard. Uh, there is one thing I wanna trigger in, in the room that I saw off stream at some point, and you guys never saw. And I was wondering if, if I can make it happen if Norman is a little bit tipsy, you know? You're sad you wanted to hike? Well, tomorrow is another day, you can do it tomorrow. Oh, this is new. No, it's not you. You get to hang here and fall asleep again. <laughs> if my stream is good for something, it's putting you back to sleep. Oh no, stop that. Stop it. Forty-four likes by BB. One like by BB. Well, that was different. I was super sleepy. We're always super sleepy. Ha! Forty-five likes. Yes. Hmm. 
What else can we do? I've never seen a cutscene during the mirror sequence, ever. Nothing ever happens. I feel like this is a lost opportunity. And I... Six likes. Okay, I think we're done here. I can't believe that Kojima missed the opportunity to add something spooky in the in the mirror at any point. There's gotta be something that I'm not seeing. Come on, Bibi didn't like that? Okay, last one. No, no more likes by Bibi. He's done. He's bored. Okay, back. Play back. And shower. Sam, do you copy? As you might have suspected, time here stopped while you two were on that battlefield. If my thinking is correct, the dimension to which you traveled is a kind of beach. Uh, um, to, to explain a little, our bodies, our ha, all occupy the same world, but our souls, our ka, have beaches all their own. These beaches are given form inside our brains by our beliefs, religion, philosophy, and so forth. As a result, a beach can be anything, and those anythings form a multiverse. However, if many people die at once, their beaches can become entangled, creating a strand field. This phenomenon is exacerbated in wartime by omnipresent feelings of resentment and despair. Beaches are more easily and frequently entangled. On such a beach, exits vanish and experiences cycle endlessly. Um, picture it like a, a, a record player. The needle skips, playing the same phrase again and again. They're fighting a battle that has no beginning or end. Round and round it goes. Now, the battlefield you visited was in Eastern Europe in World War II. Hmm. Which is strange, given that the man you encountered, uh, Clifford Unger, played no part in that conflict. I can't explain it. But if you can connect me to the Chiral Network, who knows what we might discover. EX Grenade number zero. I thought the beaches resembled the afterlife but in a physical form of a world. Still there, Sam? If so, I have a request. When you're ready, head upstairs to the delivery terminal. Well, this, this is how I understand it. Okay, quick poo-poo and pee-pee, and we're out. Oh, wait. Was that the poo-poo or the pee-pee? I'm so confused right now. Hello? Prompts? So, my theory is that every single time we visit someone's bitch is the they are their place where they go after their death and as far as we know since uh norman is a repatriate which means he can come back to life anytime there's a void out every time he dies he can and he will visit the last uh beach or let's say the memories of the ones deceased around that area or something like that I am not so sure. Then again, if I was trying to explain it in, you know, simple English, I would probably mess up because my brain brain doesn't work that way. I'm really bad at describing things. Nothing is happening. <sighs> Screw you, Norman. Okay, how about BB? I never checked on BB after we got him back. Oh, Lou! <clears throat> I am drunk! 
This is new. You know, you start having a theory about the game, about the story, about the lore, and then Kojima appears out of nowhere. And he's like, you know what? Everything you thought was correct. Let me tell you a story. It's all wrong. You got it all wrong. Well, nothing else happens. I guess I, I can go now. Have one of these. I, I can't. I hate it when he bites the head off. Just eat the whole th damn thing, you monster. Can I check on Lou without being drunk? <laughs> no, okay, let's go. One thing we've established is that Mads Mikkelsen or Otherwise, as Clifford Unger is the father of this child. Oh, this one's new. Can I help you? Holy shit. John, is that you? What are you doing here? My wife's checked in. They don't want to repeat it last year. I didn't know you were that Wait a second. Is that the guy with the mask? The voice. It's the same voice as the guy with the mask. We've never seen his face in the whole game. He said that he burned his face during an accident or something. Oh, okay, um, not Deadman, uh, Die Hardman. That's his code name. Shit. Okay, I'm, I'm curious to know. I'm probably wrong. This guy. The west side of that region is covered by a massive tar belt. The voice is the same. What are you John showing me? Edgenot City, the last bastion of civilization you'll find that far out. It's your final destination. Once you use the Cupid to connect it, the Cairo network will span the entire continent. The rebirth of America is so close. And remember, that's where Amelie is being held captive. We need you to bring her home safely. But before you cross the tar belt, there's one more knot we need you to tie. Hartman will help you get it done. Sam, I'd like for you to bring me a few things. First, the dog tags you took from that soldier. Tuck them away in a pocket so you don't misplace them. Second, Mama's corpse. Her, her body shows no signs of necrosis, and I, for one, would like very much to know the reason why. I was wondering about that. A closer study may yield information that could prove instrumental in helping us to overcome the death stranding. You think it'd go bad by now? I don't have much time. See to your preparations. I'll be waiting. You'll find an official order on the terminal. God, oh my god, I choked so badly. <clears throat> by just coughing. Oh, Jesus. Whew. Okay, let's send out the bots. They did an amazing job as always. Nothing at all. Zero. Uh, less than 30% damage. Uh, let's send one over here. I want one of these things to do the shopping for me because I'm lazy. I don't really want to get out of the house. Uh, 
uh, how are we doing on on things and stuff? Like, uh, what am I carrying on my back? Because I forgot. Or did we lose anything while we were in the World War Two sequence? God, I'm still <clears throat> choking. <coughs> Wait, excuse me. Recovery winter clothes. Ah. Uh... This is not part of the main quest, is it? But for some reason I want to do it. Oh yes, go make some breakfast. What are you making? Are you making pancakes? Of course, ha of course Hartman's uh, lab is next to the... <laughs> to the heart area. I thought that was a butt at first. Okay, now we know. I can do this one really quick, before we go to Hartman. Either way, our shoes are fucked, so I have to make new ones. Deliver the winter clothes to Mount City. To Mount City, I can't read. It's in the deliveries uh, list for Sam, so I'm guessing that we have to do it. Okay, says here I have two container sprays. Uh, repair sprays. Three climbing anchors. <clears throat> Fourteen blood bags? Really? I should make one of these. Or, oh, wait, before we... Omelette. Nice. I would tell you to slap some bacon in there, but... Do you even eat bacon? A truck. I want a bike. Okay, let's see what we got here. Private locker, we got equipment. That's in our private locker, right? Bridget boots, power gloves. <sighs> My boots are in poor condition. Really poor. Destroyed and used. <clears throat> I have like a million blood bags in my inventory. I'm not carrying anything on my back. What do you mean? Oh, right. Uh, Deadman mentioned when we met in our room, in my room, that um, he placed all of my belongings on my person when we left the, the battlefield in my private locker. So everything should be there. You don't cook with it? Oh. All right. So first things first. Shit. What am I doing? Bola gun. The boots. Are these destroyed? Yes, they're destroyed. I have to make new ones. Holy. Ah. Okay. This sucks. Power skeleton. Container damage. One hundred percent. Uh, all the grenades, two climbing anchors, the repair sprays, the PCCs, four PCCs. I'll take three. We do not have internet coverage for the area we're, we're about to go to. So there's no point in, cavalry, in um, carrying more than three or two. Uh, three should suffice for now. It's just a dead weight. Four blood bags. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I want one of the high-capacity ones. Carry on back. Order assigned. Let's see. First things, let's recycle the useless junk on me. Wait, I'm not... Recycle you. I could carry two more of these things. If I had any. Do I have any? I need um, a ladder, potentially. Hmm... 
There we go. Nice. And fabricate. One ladder. Oh, wait! Right. I should check the, the share locker first. Someone might have what I need. Like, look at this guy. Yes. Ah, not much here. I'm not wearing any shoes at all. Fabricate shoes. Level 3. Uh, put it on. Let's see. We have a lab ladder climbing anchor. Three PCCs. Um, we have the ball again. I'm not gonna bother too much with any other stuff. Okay. We should be good to go. Oh, whoopsie. Thank you for your Let's start with that. It's gonna be a warm-up before we... We go to Hartman. So where am I supposed to go? Where is it? Oh man. Huh. Keep on keeping up. Do the zip lines help at all? Where I want to go. Come on. Go. Maybe. Look at all these people using the roads we made. I'm so happy. Hmm. This area is pretty close to the spiritualist. And that looks like the area we got warped into the, the World War II sequence, so... I'm kind of glad we made like a couple of uh, zip lines here that actually, well, do they even connect somewhere? This feels like it's way too far away to connect. Like this one is 289, it's more than 300. I need one in between or around this area, maybe. Let's place a marker on A. All right, I see it. But, yep, it's out of reach. Okay, let's build another one. Whoa! Sorry, Lou. Who built this shit? <laughs> Amateurs. Where is A? Over there. Yeah, 
Yep, we definitely need to go higher. This is a mess. And don't get me wrong, I love the snow, but this is ridiculous. Alright, let's see if we can build one of the zip lines over here. Oh, nice. I saw a connection over there, where is it? Show me. Okay. There's an obstacle. It must be way higher than I can see. I see two connecting lines though, which is pretty pretty good <laughs> don't complain what now oh, the weather is clearing up come on, come on. I'm cold I'm lonely sad that is freezing Okay, this is perfect. <laughs> I am glad we built this one in our last session. Just don't land me. Ooh, ooh. Yeah. I forgot to check uh, how we're doing our, on internet. We have enough resources to build another one. Do not please not hold it. I need access. Perhaps up there? Okay, if I go up top this rock here, do I have a visual of the. God damn it! Come on. You are forcing me to use my. No! This is safe. This is fine. Maybe. Hmm. Whatever we built here. Ah, oh, this is broken. Nice! Free connections. Do it. All right, now, where <clears throat> where are your freaking clothes? Give them to me. Construction complete. Hey. I want to explore. I want to go back there and see what this is all about. What? Okay, there we go. This has to be the cabin. It's so nice when there's no freaking storm. The only downside is that everything on my bike is being destroyed. 
<coughs> extremely slowly. What is that? Oh. <coughs> Maybe there's a collectible over here. Who knows? <gasps> there is! <laughs> Give it to me. What kind of... What kind of gloves am I wearing, by the way? You are approaching your destination. Are those BTs though? Do we have to fight? Oh, what's over there? Haven't been there, I wanna go! Someone has placed a ladder. <sighs> okay, let's drop it. Dead weight. <sighs> nice. What do you mean nice? What did you do? If I knew this was gonna happen, I would take all the PCCs I could. Now we're... Uh... Yep, I'm out. I can't be build any more zip lines. Even so, if this is a new area, there's not gonna be internet coverage out down there. Okay, I'm in the area. I don't. I don't see any. Oh, there they are! Holy shit! Wait. Uh, then again, I could have used the um, <clears throat> the ladder, but it doesn't go all the way down. Who builds this shit? Breaking amateurs. This is how it's done. Oh yeah, we didn't run out of rope. This is nice. Mm. I might want to use another anchor, anchor here. Place it. Pla pl place it. Stay warm. <laughs> These ladders are so derpy. Oh, 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 there it is. Wait. Turn around. I can't turn around. Oh, this is bullshit. Wait. This way. Nice. No. Slowly now. Easy. Got him! Yeah, but I want to go down there! <laughs> uh, 
Hold on a second. Oh, I I can't open my inventory menu when I'm on the road. Bad idea. Come on, Norman. Come on, buddy. Don't don't slide off the freaking cliff. Just climb. Go. There you go. Easy, easy. Oh, yes, I want to see what's happening over there. Oh, oh, ah. Should have brought more of anything, of everything. Ow. Ah. Uh. We're fine. I wish I had a bike. Near where they're stationed. <gasps> I see a bike. There is hope. Yeah. Oh, oh. Some stamina. Who put the farm girl here? <laughs> oh, come on. I just repaired my things. Snow is brutal. I need that bike, and I'm gonna get it. Cosplay. Oh shit. In line safe house. <gasps> A spicy bit the ball. I like this guy's name. How far is it? I'm scared that we will get there, but there won't be anything to do, because we never got a, a, a quest for it. So it's gonna be like a blank building with someone, somebody. <sighs> I don't see the shelter anymore. It's not a random structure, it's... It is a shelter, isn't it? It is! This is the... I came all the way back. I'm such an idiot. Oh man. Why couldn't I see it on the map then? Oop!
Well, now that I'm here, I can get some more PCCs. Ah, oh, yeah, we got one of these. Nice. You don't know how long I've wanted this. Thank you. New dildo? What is it? The following data can now be viewed via your calf links. Dandelion seeds! Is that how you call it these days? Dandelion seeds? Okay. What do you want me to deliver? Mm. Yes. Oh, I wasn't supposed to give that to the bot. I was supposed to accept this for myself. Whoopsie. Maybe there's another one. There isn't. Okay. In that case. Mm. Speed skills are there. Wait. Oh. That's nothing new. That's already what we got. Um... Fabricate two of these uh, and one PCC. That's all I can get, I, I guess. Ah, that's good enough for me. Let's go back. Speaking of, wasn't that a BT area? Isn't this why most people like left their vehicles in the middle of nowhere? Okay, there's a zipline here. Does that connect? to anything at all. 93, 250, it should. This one should be able to connect. I'm sorry buddy, I'll come back for you, I promise. You must be fucking kidding me. Everything is out of reach? Son of a bitch. Okay then. I, I see, I see. I'll take the ceramics. G give them to me. Ugh. Jesus. <laughs> oh my god. The suffering is real. And you think you have enough resources, enough materials, enough items? Then again, I could just build something. And get there faster. I see another bike. Give me this. Give it to me. 
Where is the zipline? I do not see it. Insuffi- No, that can't be right. Obstacle. Fuck your obstacles. Okay, fine. I, I, I'll- Oh! Oh! Hurry, BB! I'll, I'll put it over there. <laughs> you okay, baby? Uh, Sue. So <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> You're gonna be fine. Wait, faster. Uh, there you go. Go to bed. Sleep. Good boy. He's fine. I'm so good with babies. <laughs> I would be a wonderful mother. No, it's not a good day, Norman. It's a shitty day like any other day. But you know what? We got to shake the baby. I couldn't hear it crying. If it was crying, I didn't hear anything. Okay, what's 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 up with the graphics over here? My immersion. Let's do Come on. I know you can do it. We have been through wars. This is nothing. Now. Um Nope. Nope. There we go. Can we get all four is the question. I don't think so. Three is good. Three is fine. Okay. Star, hello! How are you? You have changed terrains or seasons. Yep, we are in a new in a new map right now. I wanted something more Christmassy and the game provided. I wanna go down below. I love the snow in this game. Then again, I love everything when it comes to terrain in this game. Everything looks amazing. The design is beautiful. It looks gorgeous. I have no complaints when it comes to... to the design in this game. Everything is so pretty. And we get to hear the jingles. <gasps> there we go. What the will of world? Everything is in mint condition as requested. Make delivery. Yes. Take your stupid clothes and wear them. Hey, Sam. Welcome back. Tough journey as always, I bet. Wow, you, you really took great care of everything. I mean, honestly, you'd be hard-pressed to call this anything less than perfect. 
I like it how everybody's looking at the containers, and they just assume that the the things inside the container are in in fantastic condition as well. Oh, three percent damage. I didn't get an extra star. We're going to get through this because of you. Thank you, Sam. And why this one specifically was one of the main missions? Why wasn't that like a side mission? Like an optional? You know what? Screw you guys. I'm going over to Hartman. Take the, the lost cargo as well. Winter clothes are important in winter. True, but it could be like an optional mission. It wasn't anything story driven or... But it was one of the important missions according to the game. You had to do it. It wasn't a mission specifically for Sam. Sometimes I do not understand. I need help to understand. We used everything, right? So I'm, I'm out of PCCs, I think. But wait, there are some in my private locker. So I can take those instead. Yes, one. <laughs> Just one. Just one. Alright. One is good. Then again, I will say that we have to go to a location that there is no available internet connection, so we won't be able to build any more zip lines on the way there, at least. Uh, put it on back. Put it on back. It's good. I don't want to be bothered with recycling right just now. The animation takes too long. Screw this. Anything else I need to replace? Maybe I am your extra star all along. <laughs> Damn, girl! Okay. Power gloves. Yes, right. What kind of gloves am I currently wearing? Am I blind? I'm not wearing any gloves. I'm not wearing any gloves. <laughs> Put it on. Take another PCC. Just for fun. Downside with this skeleton for my legs is that I can't carry more than 180 kilograms per round. We do, however, have like a the power skeleton here. But is it good enough? Or has it started to deteriorate? And I'm aware. See, I have to use the PCC. This one is, you know, it's falling apart. It's melting. Mulligan, power skeleton, carry on, blah, 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 blah. Three climbing anchors. Yes. Yes. And yes. Okay. We're ready. Oh, wait. I should make another pair of boots. Before I regret that. And I run out of boots in the middle of nowhere. In the snow. Uh, wait, there we go. I am ready. Let's go to Hartman. God, I love this guy. He's one of my favorite characters in the game. Getting to the guy, though, is another problem. Uh, should I take the bike? Yes. Oh, oh my god. Oh no. Oh shit. Oh, fuck me. I forgot about... Oh. We have to take Mama's body to Hartman. And you know what that means? We, um... Can't 
take any other things. I cannot carry any extra things on my back while I'm carrying a body, because it's the only thing I can carry. Fuck me. I hate when I run out of boots. <laughs> can you imagine? I mean, that, that sounds so, so stupid. I ran out of boots. Like, excuse me? Do you mean your, your boots uh, are old? You have to replace them? No, I ran out of boots. Oh god, this is so awkward. All right, Sam. Take care of her. And don't worry, she won't go necro. Malingan special. Pinky swear! I don't trust you! Funny if these Havars ended up being the key to saving us all. Yep, that's Mama. But according to her sister, she doesn't turn necro for some reason. Order time. Okay. Oh my god. It's not like I'm leaving behind too much. Let's put that in the private locker for now. I don't want to swap. Can I hang it? On my shoulders or something? Damn it, Mama! And we have to deliver to Hartman for some reason. He wants to study her. Um, private. Sloop. Boink. And place. We don't want any of the random players on the internet, you know, stealing our stuff. We don't want that. No, no, we don't. Let's go, Mama! You and I on a magic carpet ride. Which way? Which way to uh, the Hartman boy? This looks steep. I don't want to go there. Um. Are you telling me that we have to go all the way around this area, then go down here, then go down there, and then walk? Because I would really like to skip everything and go through there, up the mountain, and then go down and reach the lab. <laughs> Let's hope she will behave. I do not trust this game. Earlier, Del Toro told us that I'm going to hand you the baby over because I... Uh, repaired him. He's fine. He's all yours. But wait a second, I want to keep him for myself. I changed my mind. And I'm like, ex excuse me? That was not part of the plan. So now I don't really believe the, the whole bullshit about Mama will not turn into a BT. Mama is safe. You are safe. I, I do not believe anybody anymore. I don't trust anybody in this game. Uh, it's a... Uh... You know what? I am gonna do... Maybe I can go through here. Okay, first there. Then there. Then we go boink and... And if we use the online zipline, that means we cannot go below because there's no extra ziplines around Hartman's lab. So I have to climb down. Over here, and then, boop! Let's hope that works. Heart-shaped lake. <laughs> or testicle-shaped lake. I know, right? It's not just me. I mean, that's what I thought it was. First I thought it was an ass when I saw it from this distance. And I zoomed in, and I'm like, oh, uh, <clears throat> testicles. <laughs> then the guy is like, okay, you have to go to Hartman's lab. It's actually an upside-down heart. Okay. Damn you, Kojima. Oof, I'm so nervous. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Any repairs? Repair mama?
We're gonna be walking for most of the trip. So let's use these babies wisely. Obstacle detected? Who the fuck built this shit? Come on, I just built those. Are you kidding me? I was able to go down here from over there. What is this? Oh my god. The shape of the lake is in the eye of the beholder. <laughs> god. The moment the beaties went through, my Twitch on phone died. <laughs> Thank you so much for the beaties. My god. What is happening on Twitch? Not really Twitch, the Twitch app on phone is disgusting. Also, Jimmy, thank you for sending me a picture of your third monitor. I, 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 <laughs> I almost broke my, my, the only one monitor I have. I'm so jelly. But it, it looks amazing, by the way. Your setting is crazy, man. It's so good. Can we get the Twitch app to work, please? Today. Please and thanks. Oh my goodness. It's not working. It keeps crashing. I can't even get to my chat before... Do, are we fine? Is it working? No, it crashed again. Welcome to the chat! Sorry about killing your Switch app. <laughs> Again, thank you for the biddies. It's it's all under control. Oh, oh! I was going the wrong way. Whoops! I wouldn't have seen it. If Twitch didn't crash, that I'm going the wrong way. Still, I'm a little pissed that uh, I, I I built a zipline that worked fine when I went down the mountain, and now that I want to go up the mountain, it's like, hey, you cannot see it. You have to build another one and dismantle the previous one. Aha, I gotcha. Come on. Come on. Is this stream running at 5 FPS, or is it just a preview that is bored? Come on, Mama. Nice. Mama is extremely heavy. Oh my god. Oh god, look at all this stuff. A repair spray. Can I pick this up without dropping mama? It's... can put it in my pockets. Can I? No! Ugh! Excuse me. Mama will protect me. Oh, this is rough. <laughs> Image of two Spider-Man pointer at each other. <laughs> oh god, oh god, no, 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 no. Fucking hell. I'm using so much stamina up here. Stop. Take a breather. Drink some monster. Ugh. I have to keep an eye on my balance, on my stamina, on everything. Come on, go up, go up. You know what's missing here? A snowstorm. I need... Gods of Death Stranding, I need a snowstorm! Give it to me! Oh... Oh! How about BTs instead?
Jingle bells, buttman slell, slells. What? Buttman smells. Robin laid an egg. Okay, easy, easy, slowly now. Freezing. Wait, wait, no, that's not what I wanted to do. Fuck you! No, 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 no. stop it! Stop walking for a moment. Just take it easy. Take it easy. Breathe. Good. I wanna make... I wanna make sure we have enough internet to build here. I'm not gonna build anything. Come on, Barbie, let's go party. No, come, please, no! Come on, Barbie, let's go party. No, no, no! BTs. BTs. Thank you again. What am I doing with my life? Oh! What am I doing with my life? Why? Stop walking! Thank you everybody for the lights. Up! Steady. Up! Go up! Go up! Oh my god! There you go! Oh, I can feel the struggle in real life. Well, let's get this show on Okay. I do! As a matter of fact, we have internet! So that means, you know what that means. Oh baby, I'm building zip lines. fuck everything. Let's make my life a little easier! Come on, Bobby, let's go party. Oh, you're- uh, oh, you are right here. Whoopsie. Uh, um... Well then, ne never mind, I don't want to build anymore. <laughs> yeah, but this one is behind the mountain, it doesn't access that one. Oh, uh, that's... that's annoying. Oi! Oi! How far away are you? Three... Oh! Does it connect them? It does. Where's the other one? Oh, oh. oh god! Building zip lines is... It's a very delicate process. It doesn't connect with anything else. Do I want to build it there? Do I? I do! Please, build it! I wanna go down there really fast! Come on. Come on. Yes. Mama, are you okay? Are you okay, Mama? You've been hit by a smooth criminal. Let's go. Whee! Wait. Uh that uh that's a <laughs> that's the doctor, not the Oops! Wrong way! <clears throat> Never mind. Bye, Doctor! It couldn't be that easy. It's never that easy. <gasps> oh my god! Okay, mama. The 
this is gonna be the hardest part. Please, whatever you do, do not turn necro on me. Oh, this is where the internet ends. Look at that, look at that line, we've reached it. Disconnected. Mama, ooh, ooh, oh, didn't mean to make you cry. If I'm not back again this time tomorrow, carry on, carry on as if nothing really matters. Is it come? Is it go? <clears throat> I love that song. Mama. I, I I love the way she she read that the, the text to speech is always mind blowing. <laughs> Mama, ooh ooh oh! <laughs> I love it so much. We just did! Sam! Look at this, we, we did it! What do you mean there's no way to climb this? Look where we are! I'm the king of the world, baby! Oh. Hmm. Wasn't so bad. Anyway, the wind blows. I don't want to die. I sometimes wish I'd never been born at all. <laughs> oh man, thank you again for all the biddies. I appreciate you. God, that's a uh, some establishment you have here. I didn't think it would be that big. Uh, release. Collectibles. Any a shotgun? Any collectibles? No. Damn, this place is big. Do I have to spray Mama first? Because, you know, maybe she... No? No hairspray? Okay. Where's the door? This is a freaking nice place. Text-to-speech does not like contractions. She's trying her best, okay? She's trying. Delivery complete. Displaying performance evaluation. Zero. Nice. Very nice, very nice. Request to join UCA registered. Awaiting Cupid connection. Ah, <clears throat> oh, thank goodness this guy wanted to be part of the UCA. I didn't have to convince anybody.
The testicles are ours now. I mean, the heart. Well, the heart. Hartman's lab has joined the UCA. <gasps> A thermal pad. What is that? Please proceed into the facility with a cadaver. Right on. Good work. New order available. Please access delivery terminal for further information. New order available? Tell me more. Oh, for bots. Okay. Might as well do those. Oh my god, Twitch crashed again. Oh, I swear my, my phone is dying. <laughs> they can't afford a new one. <laughs> I hate everything. Uh, please load. <laughs> uh, guys, give me a second, because I'm disconnected from chat. I'm disconnected from everything. I, for, for some reason, the flashlight turned on on my phone. That was not my intention. Um... Oh god, this is infuriating right now. Wow, look at that! I see he's a collector. Well, you certainly caught me with my pants down. Glad you could make it, Sam. <laughs> I'm sorry. I didn't mean to alarm you, but I am what I am. Ah, please, lay her down there. Still no sign of them. You know, your heart stops beating. It stops every 21 minutes. I spend three minutes on the beach, and then return. 60 deaths and 60 resurrections per day. 60 opportunities to search the beach for my departed family. Oh my god. This is how I live. This is my life. So, while you've traveled to and from the seam an impressive number of times, my beach count is a little higher. 218,549. <laughs> I see myself in that crater. My wife and my child. It's like looking at the shape of my heart. The doctors called it myocardial cordophonia. 
Mine is an especially unusual case. I have pictures. Care to see heart whence heart shape heart? <laughs> no, you really should. It doesn't run in the family. You know, I never came to terms with their loss. In the days that followed, I became obsessed with an idea that the beach is real and they are on it. I would induce cardiac arrest three minutes at a time and search for them day after day after day. Oh, so you could say goodbye? Quite the opposite. It is said that everyone's beach is different. So what if everyone's afterlife is different too? I find the thought terrifying, spending eternity alone, which is why I decided to find my family and make sure to move on with them. You mean die with them? If death would see us reunited, then yes. But the repeated cardiac arrests took their toll on my heart. The muscle gradually deformed. And after a while, they started calling me the beach scientist. <laughs> Hartman. I'm glad we could have this conversation. Oh. Um. A body that doesn't necrotize. No sign of decomposition. It's as if she were still alive. The perfect mummy. An impeccable corpse. What's wrong? Where's the other thing you were supposed to bring? Ah, found it. Behold. Wait, dead man. It appears to be an umbilical cord. Human by the looks of it, I think. But... This was no ordinary conduit between fetus and placenta. It looks more like BT's tether. And this was Mama's? Yes. Hmm. A body that doesn't necrotize and an umbilical cord connected to the beach. These are remarkable discoveries, Sam. Enough to set my sore heart racing. Five minutes to cardiac arrest. I apologize if our conversation gets cut short. I must go back to the beach and look for my wife and child. One person, one beach. That's the rule. But I'm the exception. My beach is connected to others, as if it were the beneficiary of a coronary bypass. Maybe this twisted heart of mine made it possible. All I know is that I will find them. Even if my every visit raises new questions, I'll have my answers one day. One day. Three minutes to cardiac arrest. The battlefields. The endless wars you found yourself trapped in. Why do World War era soldiers wander the beach a century after they fell? Normally the souls of the dead move on. The beach is just a corridor, a place through which they pass on the way to the other side. But if regret, uh, resentment, a, um, a fervent desire to remain, if these feelings are powerful enough, they may give rise to an altogether different beach, a collective purgatory for an army of the damned. Clifford Unger. His misery and hatred, combined with your BB acting as some sort of catalyst, have brought these battlefields to our world. Two minutes to cardiac arrest. Please proceed to a safe location. It's just a theory. 
You think Higgs is pulling his strings? Pulling all their strings? Ensure you are in a stable position. I don't know. But evidence does suggest that Higgs brought them here. One minute remaining. Please hold on to something secure. Oh, before I forget, I have a favor to ask. Activating lab security measures. Could you just relax until I come back? Time stops on the beach, but not in the scene. Rest assured, it'll only feel like three minutes to you. We'll continue this shortly. Five, four, three, two, one. This is insane. Oh my god, poor guy. Okay, I take I take it this is his family, his wife and child. Take record player. A known ore recovered from Void Out Crater. This game is crazy, Jimmy. I don't I don't even <laughs> Crypto Cryptobiotes discovered immediately after the stranding. Oh god, it's the things we eat. Ugh. Chiral crystal immediate post DS period. Oh god, it's your nose. PT apparition artist's impression. Damn, look at that. PT illustration artist's impression sightings 3. Sighting 3, sorry. What are these? Meeting model, artist's impression, sighting 2. Both of these? Moment remains. A whale! Hardwanter, Guardian of Life. It's been almost three minutes already. <laughs> Can't zoom in in any of these. <gasps> Nendoroid Jumbo Ludens. Oh god, I want this in real life as well. I, I love this so much. Can I stand up? No. Bourbon? Possibly. What are these? Ordovician period or recovered from tar belt. Hmm. Anything else? Oh god. <laughs> it scared me. Mamma mia, mamma mia, mamma mia, let me go. Pum 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 and, no, now that I'm acclimated to it, it isn't especially, uh, onerous. Defecation, ablution, nutrition... Most of life's basic functions fit rather easily into a 21-minute time slot. <laughs> Sleep is the tricky one, and intercourse, I suppose, verbal or physical. Not that, that someone in my position... Has that if you last more than 20 minutes. <laughs> 
Do, do you read, Sam? Uh, listen to music. Watch films. You know, I keep busy. I have a collection of music, uh, television shows, some very interesting short films, and stories. Everything consumable within a 21-minute window. You have too many duplicates. Oh, from before the Death Stranding, of course. <laughs> But honestly, the 21 minutes I spend here, all downtime, nothing more. Time spent waiting to go back to the search. My body may be present, but my soul is on the beach. I'm already dead. I know that feeling. Lost my family in an accident. Well, I never expected you to open up to me. <laughs> As it happens, I've read about your circumstances. I lost my family in an accident, too. I was in the ICU having heart surgery, out of town, in the city. When it was clear that I was going to pull through, my wife took my daughter back to the house to collect some things for me. And then they were caught in the void outs. The city and the hospital were spared the worst. But the shockwave knocked out the power and my life support. I woke up on the beach. <laughs> The people who died in the two void outs were there. What happened? What's going on? I saw my wife and my daughter in the procession. Hey, it's me! Where are you going? Wait! Don't leave without me! No! Don't go! Please, don't go! The ICU's backup generator kicked in, and I was brought back to life by the defibrillator. Exactly 21 minutes after my heart had stopped. And that was the last time I saw my family. It's my damned heart's fault that we were torn apart. But it's also the reason I'll see them again someday. Will not be enough time, it like, finds me. enough time for... I am Hartman. Ever since, I've walked the beaches of others. That time, that 20 minutes, would be enough for, for permanent brain when damage, I retired, but... I return here to continue my research. It's funny, though. Even when my heart stops, the pain... lingers. Um, you have any family photographs, Sam? I love this guy. Pity. Five minutes to cardiac arrest. You mind telling me what I'm doing here before you go back to the beach? Oh, um, of course. There's a prepper own station in this area. Our scientists stationed there are researching material from before the Death Stranding. What kind of material? The Earth has a long memory. 
It's straw to tell a story, one that goes back to the very beginning, one that not even the Death Stranding could erase. The scientists are all colleagues of mine from the earlier expedition. I'd like you to bring them onto the chiral network. Amelie proposed we establish our research posts along this belt. Despite a worldwide search, this is the only area known to contain fossils from the late Cretaceous period, <clears throat> when the dinosaurs died out. The assumption being that the last ones lived here and here alone. You see, hiding in the earth then are memories of a major mass extinction. Clues that could tell us how to survive our predicament. Certainly, that was Armley's hope as part of the advanced team when she assigned our backup team here. The past informs the present and aids us in building the future. She was careful to impress that upon us before she went west. Three minutes to cardiac arrest. Shut up. I'm putting you on mute. Some time later, we began to observe unusual activity in the tar belts outside Edgenot City. Vast quantities of tar began surfacing, spreading, consuming many of my colleagues, as well as a chiral way station. The whole incident defied explanation. You think Higgs is to blame? I don't know, but we needed that way station. It was essential to expanding the chiral network westward. That's why I'm asking you for your help in building a new one. It won't be much given the handful of equipment we've uh, managed to scrape together. Nothing like the Knot Cities, that's for sure. But a Knot is still a Knot. Sam, I want you to use the Cupid to put the scientists on the network, then go to Armory. Afterwards, we can get back to the important job of researching the deaths. <sighs> He gave them back to me. He is now my favorite character in the game. <laughs> I love this guy. Sam, you heard him. You can grab the order out of the delivery terminal. Oh man. Okay, another observation I forgot last time when we played uh, during the previous stream. Uh, you remember the, um, the photograph? Sam keeps close. All the time, it's his mother, himself, and there's a, a third, uh, a second woman in the picture. That I always thought is Amelie, uh, Amelie or whatever the hell her name is. I thought it was, uh, I thought the woman in the picture was his sister. And as it, <clears throat> as it seems, the woman in the picture is actually his uh, dead wife. Because the, the woman in the picture doesn't look... She, she looks nothing like his sister, that's one. And second of all, the woman in the picture is, a, is pregnant. Okay. He agrees! Our ultimate objective in this region is to build a replacement for a way station that was lost to the tar. The first step is to put a shelter with our scientists on the chiral network. Now, we don't know the first thing about Emily's status or what Higgs is up to. That's a concern for us, as much as you. But we won't know more until we get to Edgenot City. And that means connecting this region first. You should start with the geologist and the paleontologist. The latter's holding something for the Evo Devil biologist, so I recommend you save her for last. 
That way, you can finish a delivery and link up the final site in one go. Once all three are on the grid, come back here. Then we can get to work on the replacement for that lost way station. Oh boy. Oh, that's new! Thermal pad. Indispensable gear for cold weather operations. Especially useful when traversing snow-capped mountains. Yeah, but what does it do other than warm me up? Thermal pads will drain battery when activated. Be sure to keep an eye on your battery levels. I want one! I will make one! Yes! Nice! A <laughs> portable heater. Okay, the repair spray is used. I can get rid of that. Uh, was there something else I needed? Climbing on course. Check. Do we have a... Do we have a ladder? I don't see a ladder. How many PCCs do I have? None. Alright. Uh, share... A PCC and a ladder. Oh, baby, yeah. Give me all of these babies. There we go. Okay, where should we go first? Geologist. Even <laughs> so, the distance, dude, like... The mountain area sure is steep. How do you guys live up here? I have questions. A geologist of ours has been studying fossils as part of his research into prehistoric extinction events. He's been out there conducting excavations for a while now and has begun to suffer the effects of chiral contamination. No doubt the result of excessive exposure to chirelium during the dig. Until the site is properly decontaminated, his work can't proceed. Nor will his health improve. So we need you to bring him some chirelium scrubbing agents. Administering shock. Stand clear. He's the awake! The team was investigating dates from the end of the Cretaceous period. The time of the infamous mass extinction, which brought the reign of the dinosaurs to a close, leaving small mammals to inherit the Earth. It's the most recent of the Big Five, and one of the largest mass extinctions the world has ever seen. In any event, our team found something truly remarkable. Can you guess what it was? A fossil beach. If that is indeed what it is, then he has made a tremendous discovery. Therefore, Sam, it is essential that you deliver those Chirelium scrubbing agents as soon as possible. Yeah, but I need PCCs. Two of them? Sure. Wait, what? Load everything? Optimize. And let's get out of here. Wait, how- wait, how he heavy am I? <gasps> oh. Acceptable weight. Which way? Let's see. Um... Hmm. We could go around the lake, go up, then here. That doesn't look so bad.
Bungie, hey! Welcome. How are you? I'm here, suffering in the snow, making deliveries. How are you doing? Sam, so Hartman told you all about the lake. How the attack that created it changed his life forever. Not only did he lose his family, he very nearly lost himself. For 21 minutes, he was in a state of cardiopulmonary arrest. Under normal circumstances, he would have died. Therapeutic hypothermia saved his life. But the 21 minutes he spent on the other side had a lasting effect on him. Perhaps due to the shock, his doom's ability seemed to have increased. And now he takes every opportunity to walk the beach in search of his family. My apologies, Sam. You came all this way to visit me, yet I neglected to give you a proper farewell. Do be careful out there. As I mentioned before, this region is rich in memories of death, extinction. It should come as no surprise that VTs are sighted here more frequently. Perhaps you recall the models in my lab. Their designs were all based on eyewitness accounts. Though I suppose they must have struck you as strange, considering the many times you've come face to face with the real McCorn. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, I get it. There are like a million BTs up here. I'm prepared. Let's say that the first thing I want to do is just build zip lines. So I have easy access back to the guy's lab. Let's go around. Your internet is dying? How's the weather in your area? Because it's been extremely crappy for me here. It's raining, there are storms, plus... The internet is not stable, far from it. I'm taking a bit, uh, a big risk streaming today. But I really wanted to see What's happening in this game? So interesting. Oh my goodness. Can we connect... Um, that one... At the top? Preferably. A little higher. Some. Go! What is that over there? <gasps> is that a bike? Yeah. Your weather is fine. 55. Wait, there's... There's another one. I can go even higher, I guess. Let's do it. Ooh, ooh. <laughs> Look at all these vehicles in the middle of nowhere. Should be a good place for one. Um, maybe. I can see one line, 191. Where's the other line at? I don't see the other line. 354. Oh my god! What's happening? No! I wanna place it a little higher. Don't, don't, don't trip. Stop it. Higher. Higher. 205, 206. Can we hit the limit which is 300? Possibly.
Oh, 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 no more internet. This is the limit. Fuck. Come on, buddy. Hmm. Shit. Two, nine, ten, eleven. All right. This should do it. So close to entering the BT territory. Construction complete. Oh no. I do not like the sound of that. the right way. <laughs> this is so scary. Oh god. It's a first. <laughs> Are you guys done? No more. What's that over there? Oh, no, 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 no. That's not good. Uh, <coughs> have to repair that. As fast as possible. Stay focused. <laughs> okay. We got our stamina back. Why do I feel like I'm going the wrong way? Show me my map for a moment. Seems like I took a shortcut. It's not that bad. I have to repair the containers. Easy. Easy. This guy scared me! You bastard! Hi! So much better. Did it! Perhaps we don't have to go around. I can. I could use a rope. But do I want to use a rope? Now I'm gonna save the rope. There. 
There we go. Beginning scan. Scanning bridges ID. Fragile Express ID verified. I haven't seen a collectible in a long, long time. Come on! Perfect. More. That is not enough. Wait, that's all I have? I can't repair anymore? Oh no. It's empty. Um... Well... It's not in perfect condition, but take it in... Nevertheless, I'm sorry. Delivering cargo. Sam Bridges. Oh, thank God for that. I, I was worried you might not get here in time, but then I've done nothing but worry of late. I've been haunted by those visions you doom sufferers see. That end of day stuff? I put the nightmares down to fatigue. A uh, possibility of chiral contamination never even occurred to me. Oh, it's just lucky we caught it before the suicidal stage. Dying's not an option. My research is nowhere near complete. It's not just my life you're saving here. It's my life's work. I started to wonder if I'd ever see these meds. I guess you really are good at what you do, huh? Thank you. Yeah, but are they okay? Zero percent damage, yes! Oh my god, yes! Ah, oh, the bots did it again. Nice. Oh, yes. Right then. <laughs> if you'd do the honors. Was that a, a heart on the baby's elbow? Huh. Oh yes, give me all the internets. <gasps> a new climbing anchor! What does it do differently? Is it longer? The rope? Interview with the geologist. Oh my god! That's, that's what would happen if we take the west route. It was like filled with BTs for like five kilometers. And just like that, I'm part of the UCA with access to a treasure trove of historical research materials. Studying this fossil beach should be a good deal easier now. Assuming I can prove once for all that that's what it is. Honestly, though, I'm just excited I can finally share these findings with everyone. Can you believe I found chiral deposits in strata dating back 65 and a half million years? Exciting! Evidence of an ancient death stranding. Chiral matter has existed on Earth since long before the dawn of man. This stratum is proof of that. Look at this, Sam. Do you see that black fissure there? We believe this is the source of the Chirelium readings. In the distant past, Earthquakes cause frictional melting along fault lines, producing layers of what is known as pseudotachylite. We call these layers fossil earthquakes. Extending the principle, our fissure here is what one might term a fossil beach. The presence of corellium in this of all strata cannot be a mere coincidence. 
It strongly suggests that beaches must have appeared during the Cretaceous Paleogene extinction event. And not just then. The chiral network has recovered data suggesting that similar fossil beaches were discovered in strata corresponding to other extinction events too. That would seem to indicate the Big Five and all other major extinctions were accompanied by the appearance of beaches. In expanding the chiral network, you've helped us glimpse a pattern in these scattered points of data. You furthered our individual research projects and ensured that it is only a matter of time before we recover all we have lost and solve every mystery that remains. But this is only the beginning. See this through, Sam, and there's no telling what we might learn. Good work. New order available. Please access delivery terminal for further information. For a last meal, only pizza will suffice? Oh my god, this guy is at it again! From like the, the first map. He's asking for more pizza. Let's see. What would you like me to send you? Um... Uh, take the art. Yes. Everything in my inventory is melting away in in the snow. This is insanely fast decomposition. Okay, we got the bots ready. Uh, orders. Oh, yeah. An improved version of the climbing anchor. It's more com uh, compact form, enables more anchors to be packed into a single container. It also boasts... Excuse me, I was re... <coughs> Can be driven to the ground, great, blah, blah. Okay, I know how to use it. Thank you. Um... What I want to do is, first, the baller gun. Let's put that offload. All my things are falling apart. I have two climbing anchors on me. Uh, two PCCs, three climbing anchors, okay. Spare boots, a ladder. We don't need anything else, do we? I could use another Hemati grenade, thank you. Put it in there. Oh, wait. Take on a new order for some. Wait, I have to go back? But weren't we... Oh, I should have accepted both of the missions. I'm so dumb. Why? What have I done? <laughs> Give me one PCC. I'm sad. Oh, I didn't think of that. Now the question is, can I rest with Hartman's lab if I want to? That's what? I know, right? I'm so dumb! The upside is that we can now repair... Uh, not repair, we can return and play some zip lines on the way back. <laughs> oh god, I feel so stupid. There we go. <sighs> I like suffering. Suffering and pain is my middle name. That was close. At least one up there. Hopefully one, at least one of them connects. Wait, speaking of, um, if we do one here, I can place another one there. And then what? Ooh, it's so far away. 
<laughs> so far away. This is the one we built. Um, I can place one over here. On the sea. Like, either way, I have to go back, because the, the next client is around these parts, here. And the other one is here. Somewhere. Oh, God. Doom has come to our families. <coughs> Excuse me. And I'm running out of battery for my legs. I never took the time to recharge. <gasps> okay, we're so close to the sea. That might save me a lot of trouble. If I do it right this time. And please don't build in the beat area, thank you. God damn it. Man. I know, right? What is this? Do you just pee into snow? What a nice guy. I'm so worried about my battery. <laughs> I'm so freaking worried. What will happen when we run out? I didn't even think of fabricating a spare pair of uh, legs. Okay. This is where we built... Uh, yeah? <gasps> There's one over there! We're saved! Please. Let's do this. Let's go. This is done. This ain't it. What do you mean? You don't want to pee? Can't do it now. I believe in you. Drain the lizard. This is a lifesaver. I'm so happy! <laughs> it worked! We did it! Honey, I'm home! Is there a, a place to charge my, uh, my, my, my legs around here? Maybe? If there is one, I don't see it. Hartman's lab. That's a generator over there. So actually, there is. A place to charge my legs. No, 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 no. Copyrighted music. No, no, we don't want that. Yes, I know. There it is. Who the fuck? Build it over there. You know what? Screw the generator. I'm, I'm going to, to sleep. I needed this, my baby was freaking out.
Very nice. And this gives us a chance to check the emails and all that junk without worrying about everything falling apart in my backpacks. The spiritualist, nothing. The craftsman, BTs that aren't affected by your blood. <coughs> Excuse me, what? There is such a thing? <coughs> blah, 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 blah. Speaking of all things schematic, though, we've received a report that suggests there are some BTs out there that aren't affected by your blood. The BT in question glowed bright red. Apparently, and the poor porter who ran into it barely lived to tell the tale. That's new. He'd brought plenty of hematic grenades with him, but they didn't seem to do the trick. Spare me, Moji. As you can imagine, this is seriously a uh, concerning development. I mean, your blood was the only weapon we had against those things. What are we supposed to do now? Sure, they're bound to have some kind of vulnerability, but uh, we can exploit. But how many of us are going to have to die finding out what that might be? Anyway, consider yourself warned. I'm trying to scroll down. Be careful out there, blah blah. Okay. And that's the pizza guy. My dear Mr. Sam Bridges, once again it is I, Peter Englert. And once again, I must implore you to fulfill an urgent request. Come on, Barbie, let's go party. No, no, please, please, no. no. Come on, Barbie, let's go party. No, no, no. Bad BTs. <laughs> bad. They are so bad. Where is it? Okay. I speak, of course, of pizza. Before you declare me unforgivably shelf selfish, I know that on this occasion I write you on your behalf of my elderly father, who has been fiendishly out of sorts of late and has even divulged me to, his, uh, to me his dreams of the beach. You can imagine how I felt upon hearing such dreadful news. I fear he might not be long for this earth, and that being the case, I cannot bear the thought he might shuffle off this mortal coil, I will never sample the transcendental, trans transcendental, transcendental delights you deliver. Could you help me grant him his final kindness by faring the dish in question from Mountain Nut City? <gasps> That's quite far. My father has often spoken of his fondness for salami. If you could ensure that this last supper is stopped with a copious servings of said sausage, you could die a happy man indeed, I'm sure. Can I, can I have pizza for my last supper? Lucky guy. Thanks for delivering the coat and boots. Oh, the winter clothes. I see. But did you give me something? Did you give me anything at all? All right. Pizza delivery. Wait, what? What? I want to take a shower, right? EX grenade number zero. Dirty, dirty boy. Should, should we do the, the pizza delivery just for shits and giggles? It's gonna be hard, I know that much. The last pizza delivery I did off stream, I had to carry a freaking bottle of sh champagne or wine by hand and just walk all the way for like 20 minutes. It took me like 15 to 20 minutes to complete the, the mission. But uh, if chat wants me to, I will... Definitely do it. Hey, Lou. Oh. How's my baby doing? He's fine. Customize backpack. I want to change the colors. Black is very, it's super boring. I'm gonna make it red because it's Christmas. Or green because it's Christmas. Red because it's Christmas. Yes. Yes. Deliver the pizza. Oh yeah, you are an enabler. Okay. I'm. What are you showing me? What is it? Some beer. I need to be drunk to do this delivery right. 
all of it. Upside is we don't have to walk on snow anymore because there's no snow below Mount Mountain Nod City. And the guy is basically stationed in the first map of the game. That's the only delightful part of it. Because it's Christmas. Right. I'm ready. Oh, the hat has to be red as well. Mm-hmm. Everything needs to be red. Let's do it the right way. Ugh. Well, you know what? Why not? Everything red. Oh, you uh, you want the hat green? Sure, let's do it. Green hat. Hmm, I don't like this one. This one is the one. How about the glasses, by the way? Did you always wear a Dreamcatcher? Yes, that was a gift from uh, my sister to me. I believe or my mother to me I'm a little confused when it comes to uh, Bridget my mother and Amelie who is my sister because they both look exactly the same so I'm not sure which one gave me the dream catcher it's either or um, glasses green and hat gray. let's see what does this look like hmm Red might be a little too much for the hat, I believe. Maybe the hat should be red because we don't we don't get a, a Christmas hat in the game, I guess. So, oh wait, no, whoops, red. Let's see what this looks like. It's probably so bad and so ugly looking, but I I'm willing to wear it. Oh my lord! Okay, let's go. <laughs> it's so bad. I love it. We're doing it. Santa is, is in business. Please do the thing. Please do the thing. Please trigger the event. Please do it. Shit. I hate you so much, game. I hate you so much. There is one thing happening near uh, Sam's legs. I saw it only once during um, a session I did off stream. And it was freaking... I'm not gonna spoil it for you, but it was freaking amazing. I'll just say that. What a beautiful, stylish man. I know, right? Just look at you. You're so beautiful. You're beautiful! <laughs> Lou didn't like that. I'm ready. You know what? I will have to um, fast travel for this one to get where we want to go. We're extremely far away from uh, the area. Mountain Knot City should be the the pickup area. I remember well. Uh, all currently carried cargo will be placed in this facility's private locker. Yes. Been a while, Sam. It's good to see you. Remember how to do this? You need to close your eyes and picture your destination. I'm not Sam. Ho ho ho. I'm Sam.
He didn't ask for a drink, right? He just asked for pizza. Let's make that clear. Just pizza. Okay. Um... Oh no! My beautiful attire! Gordon glasses... The cap... Weapons detected. Yeah! Yeah! All clear. Well <laughs> the green is so bad! <laughs> Alright. Um... Take on orders. There it is. Keep flat, fragile, okay. I know all that. Except, um, I don't need any of this stuff really. All I need oh, God, how do I get there? How do I get there without fucking it up? Okay, so we are over here and we need to go. Here. I can use the road. Potentially. Oh, whoopsie. Um, the only thing I need is a, a couple of stuff on my back so I can keep the pizza flat. Or I could just take, like, uh, one of the trucks. <laughs> Can I build my own truck? I want to make it red. Like fire. No, I, I, never mind, I can't. That, that is... Alright. Just, just give me a freaking regular truck, whatever. Just give me this one. So if I carry it on back, it will look like this, and it has to be flat. Uh, so... Let's put it on the floor for now. Um... Carry on back. Yeah, so if I have that on my back, it will keep the pizza flat on top of it. Science! Oh, wait, don't, 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 don't do that. Don't, just put that on. Not like that! Carry on back. Can I... Oh, I don't want it like this! Screw you! I hate it. I hate it. Assault rifle, shotgun... Just, just put a PCC back there, please. Uh, this is so confusing when I want to just put it on my back, backpack. Uh... There we go. How about now? Yes, it's flat. Perfect. Hey! You know what the problem is? I can't take the truck with me. Order assigned. Delivery parameters updated. Time limit set. Is it flat? Please tell me it's flat. Oh my lord. I have to use the zip lines because I never completed the road. That is gonna be a problem! Okay. Yeah, goodbye. Well, yeah, fuck the truck. I don't need you anyway. Right over there. Yeah! 
The car matches your glasses. I had to leave it behind though. There's no way going down there. The, the, the road ends here. And we will have to walk either way. So I'll take the zip lines, then walk to the ne next uh, terminal. I'll summon another car from the garage. That should be fine. What I do for pizza? Oh, mamma mia. Oh, 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 I see a truck. I see a truck. I'm taking it. It's red! Thank the gods! Oh, this is the best day of my life! Santa is in business! Oh god. Yeah, I know. BTs. BTs and mules. Double trouble. Please? Gotta go fast. Ugh. Maybe not this way. This is a BT area. Please no. Woo! Hey you! Hi! Get fucked! <laughs> Idiot. It is meant to be. Please don't hit me! Are we going to make it? Okay, we're fine! We did it! It should be extremely easy from now on. Yes! Let's charge the vehicle. I'm warning you that this is going to be a very long ride, even with roads. <laughs> it's pretty far away, but we can always jump back with uh, fast travel and carry on from there. Bike. I'm so tempted, but <clears throat> okay. The only way the game will make me change the truck for a bike is if we find a red bike on our way there. If not, so good oh, I 
it's raining so much. Oh no, I don't have repair sp sprays with me. Uh oh. We'll, we will make a stop. For uh, a couple of repair sprays. Thing is so slow. All right, this one is the last BT area on the map. We should be fine after this. Can I repair my pizza? No. Damn it. Hairspray on pizza, that's right. We have to- Oh my god! I was looking at chat. We, ha we have to keep the uh, container in mint condition. Damn, I built this like three or four days ago? Nice. Well done. Well done. I don't know why, but this one is one of my favorite areas in the game. Not much going on, except for like, you know, an endless spawn of BTs around here in the old warehouse, but the setting is really, really spooky. I mean, I'm glad that. Hold on. In in this post-apocalyptic world, there is still pizza delivery. If only that was real life. It would be the perfect life. But this guy is pretty much the only NPC in the game who keeps asking for pizza. Nobody else asked for pizza or groceries or all right we will make a short, a short stop here you get some hairspray I have arrived easy easy We almost ruined the salami placement on the pizza. Oh my god, and uh, Twitch crashed again. Fuck you, Twitch! I hate Christmas. I hate it. You have been awarded the title of Skill Deliverer. For all your celebrated accomplishments, however, a true legend must always strive... I see you shiver with anticipation. Yes. <laughs> As this the real life? Is this just fantasy? Caught, Caught in a landslide, landslide escape from delivery. reality. Open your eyes, look up to the skies and see. Okay. <laughs> Thank you for the biddies. I'm in chat again. You have achieved delivery volume grade 60. Thank you, bots. Thank you. We did something. Yay. Uh, I want to send you my bot. Who else wants some? The junk dealer? Is he capped? No. God, I, I need to pee. This guy is capped. The elder is fun. Wait. I am 
You sang over my clever lyrics that included pizza delivery. P. <laughs> Damn it! This is why I hate Twitch chat on phone. I'm missing all the good stuff. I suck. Deploying autonomous delivery bot. Yes, summon it. Let's not forget why we're here. I wanted like uh, some spray for my pizza. Thank you very much. Uh, or maybe we can get it for free, right? No? N no? Oh no. I can't get it for free. Nobody has it? Someone? Anybody? Oh, fuck you guys. Okay, I I'll make one then. Fine. Here. Put it, put it, put it on back there. Have to be extremely careful not to optimize, otherwise the pizza will go to shit. Thank you, darling. We're out. We're almost there. Almost. We can do this. Ten minutes. Wow. I am slow. Caught in a landslide, time for pizza delivery. <laughs> That's right. I'm on a freaking diet, otherwise I'd say, okay, screw everything. I'm going to order pizza for, for the night. But I can. Wait, what, what's happening with my truck right now? Why is it stopping? That is so, so weird. Okay. Let's take a left here. That's right here, right? Yep. Whoop. My pizza delivery takes more than 60 minutes to arrive, so this guy should be grateful. I'm delivering in such impossible conditions. Wait, where is he? Oh. <laughs> Thank you again for the biddies. Pizza must be stopped. Oh, uh... Can you please drive in a straight line? What's wrong with you? It doesn't go in a straight line. Look at that shit. Come on. There we go. I am here with your pizza. Oh wait, a slice is missing. Don't mind. Don't mind me. I mean, Santa got hungry on the way here. See? Best pizza ever. Take it. <laughs> pizza must Delivery not be product. stopped. You're not wrong there. <laughs> Delivery complete. Displaying performance evaluation. This guy's star never goes up. Ever. I'm stuck at... Almost one star with a guy. Thank you for your continued support. I don't even know what he looks like. He never appears. Show me your goddamn face. Oh my god. Thank you. He will send me an email. Apologizing. For not being able to uh, accept the pizza himself. And instead, you know. Had to feed his daddy. And never get tips! Ever! 
I'm not even getting paid. Wait a minute. You have to get paid to get tips, right? There it is. Oh, okay, okay, okay. What? On behalf of the dead, I give you my undying thanks, my dear Mr. Bridges. You cannot possibly know how perfect your timing proved to be. At the very moment your pizza arrived, my dear father had all but set out on his final journey to the great beyond. Oh, he never... Did I kill your father or... No, he never tried the pizza, so you... Huh. Which is why I was unable to thank you, you understand. But you will surely find comfort in the wonder you deliver... <coughs> find comfort in the wonder your delivery wrought. Before he breathed his last... Daddy Dearest took his first bite of pizza. I killed your father. <laughs> it was the hairspray, wasn't it? The remainder of which I later consumed out of respect. Of course you did, you asshole. He proclaimed it divine, the nectar of the gods themselves. And when he finally passed, his smile was sublime. <laughs> I'm so stupid. <laughs> this dude I know, right? May I say on behalf of us both that whoever prepared it, is a wizard of the culinary arts. You have as ever my undying thanks and never a tip. Fuck you. <laughs> I hate you. Okay, so where is the easiest way? How do I jump back the fastest way? Also, I need to pee. Like, I, I'm just dancing on my seat right now. I really need to pee. Oh no, the battery is running out, no! I need the road. Come on. Come on. Whew. What if that guy is Kojima himself? And that's why he never appears to us. I never seen his face, ever. Alright, I'm not going to charge the truck. I'm gonna use the next jump in the terminal we're heading to. And go back to uh, the shelter that is closest to Hartman's lab, so we can continue from there. Again, I feel so dumb for not accepting one of his quests while I was already there. Almost there. And we get to keep the red truck. I'm not gonna be changing my clothes, I'm still Santa. The ordeal is not yet complete. Oh, perfect. I'm gonna get rid of the extra weight and... Wait a second. What if I don't? Okay, I really need to go to the bathroom. I'll be right back in a couple minutes.
back into the fray. Oh, he wants a shower, huh? Okay. Your wish is my command. More fun service for the ladies. While I drink more of my coffee. I ran out of uh, space earlier. Now I can continue drinking my coffee. You watch the dirty man. BB check and smooches. Damn it. I feel like the, the weird events just trigger once. I don't remember that being the case on PS4. I might be wrong. I might be extremely wrong. Like, I'm, I'm trying to trigger one as we speak, but... There's coffee in that nebula. <laughs> Say nothing is happening. This is infuriating. I can't get it to happen again. I hate you, game. Show me the thing. Well, all right. Let's jump back to. Wait, what? I can't use. The... There we go. We want to go. Mountain knot. Oh god, which one was it? Where was the guy stationed really close to Hartman's lab? I do not remember. Where are you, buddy? Spicy meat the ball. No, that's not the one, is it? No. <gasps> there he is. Mertesis. Yes, take me there. So, where do you want to go? Okay, there is indeed a monster under the bed. That's right. Um, Close your eyes. But I've only seen it once. Eyes. And I want to see it again. It won't, the game won't let me. And I refuse to believe it's a one-time thing only. There's gotta be something. Then again, the... The, the little weird cutscenes we had with BB early in the, early in the, in the game, they never happened twice. They just happened once and that's it. Okay. You want another shower? No, 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 no. We're out of here. Let's go. I don't want to... Talk about the pizza delivery. Sorry about the mess. I got caught in the rain. These events are not in order. But we do know that he got killed and Bibi witnessed that. 
<gasps> I'm so happy I'm back. This is probably the most convenient shelter I found in the game. I'm so grateful for this. What's happening? Is my boy okay? Why would you guys build uh, a ladder on the roof? What's, what's up with that? Collectibles, maybe? I do not understand. Alright, this is the entrance. What is that? <gasps> yes! Oh my god, this is perfect! I love it so much! Yeah, enjoy it while you can, Sam. This jacuzzi with a view has constructed and was constructed in accordance with Hartman's wishes. The water is infused with a diverse range of compounds which are not only beneficial to the body, but are also said to restore stamina and warm the heart and soul. <gasps> so good! How about my baby? Why isn't Bibi showering or swimming? He doesn't wanna. This is perfect. This is where I wanna go for Christmas. Yeah. That was great. That was so worth it! You want to soak in a tub? You wish you had one? <sighs> I feel you. Oh, oops, that's a window. That's, that's still a window. All of them are windows. Okay, let's do some standard for the extra leveling up. Very, very nice. Mountain knot, chiralium samples, do it, yes, medical text, do it, uh, do it, accept. Let's take the one we missed last time, Jesus Christ, it's just one. <sighs> Maybe I can fly over there, avoid impact. Oh, that means I have to hold it by hand. So that means maybe it was a good idea that we never accepted the quest in the first place. I, unless I went there first. Oh god, I hate the handle with care quests. I want a spa as well. Listen up, Sam. Yes. For this run, you'll be transporting an antimatter bomb. <gasps> Bridges paleontologist working on a dig says he needs it. Why? Apparently the fossils he wants to study are buried deep beneath tar. And the only way he can get to them is by blowing it wide open. We can cause a void out now, for free. I don't need to tell you to be extra careful when handling high yield explosives. But in case I do, make sure you keep that container in one piece. No matter what. Sure. Yeah. Um... Alrighty then, um... <clears throat> Before I start fabricating things randomly... Sam. Yeah? I'm sure you haven't forgotten, but you need to be extremely careful with that antimatter bomb. Yes. Especially when transporting it by a carrier or vehicle. Yes. Any irregularities should trigger an alarm. 
Don't ignore it. Oh, maybe. Okay, I can put it in my back, but I should be extremely careful with uh, the turbulence. All right, I got gotcha. you. Sure. Power gloves almost damaged. Bridges are oh, the boots are almost damaged. <laughs> Uh, excuse me, I, I left some items here. Oh god, they're in my... Uh, in the private locker of the shelter, aren't they? Well, shit. Yes. Is there a time limit for this? I can go and grab them real quick. Like anchors and stuff, ladders, um, new Order shoes. Or just fabricate a couple more, can I? Okay, give me a couple of those, give me... <laughs> Four of these, one ladder, Jesus Christ. Uh... Yes. That should be more than enough. Load everything and optimize. Perfect. Wait, how how about my portable heater? I want one. Can I build one? Where is it? No? <gasps> there it is. I want it. Make one. Uh, I'll optimize. It's fine. Oh, nice! I put it on my hip. On my, on my hip. Uh, course, nice. Thermal pad, there. Ladder, and uh, anti-matter. Life is hard. And let's make. Excuse me. Where, where, where is the, the things I need? Uh, Let's make seven. <laughs> Let's make seven, sure. Can only make one. Never mind then. Just make one. Just one. And put it in the pouch. Goodbye. Forever. I love you. Oh! That's a window. those things over there <gasps> repair spray and boots yes give it to me and stop it with a no 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 stop the music no quiet Wait, the most important thing of all, and I forgot, were your hat and your glasses. Perfect. I am Santa. Glad I'm not down there. How far are we? Let's clear everything. Can go down here ish. There, there. Don't fall off. Uh... 
Why is it beeping? I never had to bring an antimatter bomb in the mountains before, so I don't know if that's normal or not. If we hear the boom, we'll know. Yep. Yeah, I don't, I don't like this beeping. I do not like it at all. Shh. Nice and easy. I don't have uh, PCCs, right? Yeah. And we need to go all the way down where? Oh my god. Fix it for me, will ya? I do not like this. Ugh. I couldn't be walking any slower than this, and yet I'm still stumbling. Maybe use an, uh, an encore? You know? Might be a good idea. Yeah, whoa, whoa, stop! S stop! Stop it, wait. Obstacle detected? Over here. Let's go! This is fine. It's it's never been better. This is all I ever wanted from this game and more. It keeps going down. Okay, yeah, yeah I'm I'm gonna place another one. Screw this shit. <laughs> Level 2 is storing more than just two of- Oh shit, BTs, fuck me. No, please don't. Not now. Oh god, what am I gonna do? I'm still on the fucking rope! Oh my god. Where is he? Truck, but I shouldn't take the truck. Okay, let's go a little bit closer. There he is. These are different! These are big! Okay, ignore. Keep moving. Keep moving. Just keep moving. There's one right in front of me. Where is he? Regular black. This is golden. I want it. I gotta have it. Where's the cord? Where is the cord? I don't see it. 
He moved. Oh, oh my god. <laughs> One like received from BT? No fucking way! <laughs> Boy, is that even a thing in the game? Okay, please. How much further? I've rubbed my face all over the snow of this mountain. He's uh, behind us, so that's fine. It's, it's alright. Ignore it. And it will ignore you as well. Okay. Whew. Oh, there's one in front of us. So many around here. Hi, I know you're there. We could be friends. Oh, they keep going. Look at that guy. Please tell me it's over. No! No, 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 no. You don't get to get damaged. Please don't. I beg of you. That is a lot of fucking damage! Please get out of here. Stop the beeping. Where are we? This takes forever! We gotta go. Now. Hey! We did it! Yeah. Now we have to go across, right? <laughs> hmm. Slowly. Go. He is across the mountain. And as per usual, I'm using the worst route possible. Do not. I will take the ground floor. Thank you very much. I mean, I almost pressed F. Oh no, my battery. Wait, 
Left or right? Oh no. Yep, that's the way. Please change my boots. Uh. You're making socks? You're sewing socks? Oh, that's awesome. Don't worry about it. That's pretty cool. <sighs> this place is hell on earth. At the same time, it's the only place on earth I would like to be. Because snow. Go down from here. Oh, I do not know about that. I don't know about that at all. Oh, that means we're close. Game always plays music whenever we're close to our destination. Right way? Right way. is an overstatement. I don't see nobody. I don't see a shelter. I don't see every anything at all. It's just everything is white and lonely. And my battery is about to die. Hello? Where is this guy? Whoops. No, I'm not close. The, the song started way too early. Hope you're not on the mountain. <laughs> I hope you're you're on the ground floor, please. Make zip lines for this guy, I'm not coming back here ever again. What? Wow. I'm out of batteries!
ID. Fragile Express ID. Weapons detected. All weapons will be locked until departure. That's great and all, but uh, does anybody have a, a repair spray I can borrow? Because uh, the antimatter bomb is about to go boom in my own hands. Oh god. I'm not your friend. I swear, this place is bad enough without having to worry about getting asphyxiated. <laughs> not that I need to tell you. <laughs> you did it after all. Though I can't for the life of me imagine how. Join the UCA, you bastard. <laughs> Please. I beg of you. Wait. Zero damage? We did the impossible. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. I still hate you. And I don't want to come here ever again. <laughs> Just for the record. Nice. You can set up the chiral network while I work. There's one block missing in the map. What? <gasps> An oxygen mask. <gasps> Hematic grenades level two. Interview with a vampire. Yep, there is a block missing. I don't want to know. Anyway, as it turns out, Sam Bridges, I have a favor to ask. A local porter was on his way here with something very valuable, but dropped it on route. It's a 200 million year old ammonite, which looks, he says, almost as if it were still alive. Wow. He apparently stumbled across it in a boulder field, which had previously been hidden beneath a glacier, but that's not the half of it. The man claims this ammonite has an umbilical cord. <sighs> an umbilical cord. Color me skeptical, but the specimen merits study. And I wasn't about to leave such delicate work to an amateur. So it's I a BB ammonite. The whole surrounding chunk of rock and bring it here to me. Naturally, I wanted to compare it with contemporary specimens in the vicinity, which is why I had him excavate a number of those in addition to the one he told me about. But what does a dumb fuck go and do? He loses the whole shipment. Didn't even have the good sense to mark which container had the ammonite with the umbilical cord. The cargo was supposedly lost in the area to the southwest where toxic gases have a tendency to build up. Old Mr. Reliable claims his cargo scanner is broken, and there's no way he can recover the shipment. But you... you could track it down. To protect you against the fumes, I'll provide you with an oxygen mask. Just to be safe. You can pick it up when you accept the order. That fossil could represent an epical discovery. While there are examples of viviparous fish, an ammonite with an umbilical cord is unheard of. And if it is indeed 200 million years old, it would also correspond with the end Triassic extinction, another one of the big five. Could the umbilical cord be connected to the beach? We must recover that cargo at all costs. It could provide a vital clue to the mechanisms underpinning the Death Stranding. We're so close, so very, very close to grasping the true nature of the phenomenon. Hurry, Sam. 
We cannot risk that ammonite being lost. Good work. And when I New thought the mask was a gift because he liked me, he just wanted me to go fetch him something. Okay. <clears throat> I would like to have, I would like one of these. I need to make more repair sprays, dude. I can't afford to walk around with zero repair sprays in this, um, in this weather. It's impossible. Okay, he said he's going to give us the mask after we, once we accept the order, right? Right? Because I don't want to fabricate anything in your fucking shelter. I hate it. It sucks. An oxygen mask, huh? Good idea. It'll filtrate the air and keep you breathing normally. In addition to protecting you from toxic gases, it'll also help to reduce fatigue from strenuous activity, making it easier to keep your balance. If it didn't have a limited battery life, I'd tell you to keep it on the whole time. But it does, so don't. Yeah, speaking of battery, I'm all out. Do I have the means to rest around this place? He didn't give me one, right? I have to make one. Oh, screw you, dude. Fine. <gasps> it looks cool. I like it. Oh. He gave me one, and I made... I'm an idiot, dude. Yeah, climbing encores are great and all. But I need repair sprays. <laughs> repair sprays are the best. Guess I'll make one. Order assigned. Santa is back. Give me a couple of these. How about... Yeah, let's make one PCC. Nice. I am ready. <gasps> There's a shelter down there! Oh, you guys! You guys are the best! Keep on keeping on. I need to Working rest. Restrictions lifted. <sighs> is this guy flexing, stretching? What is he doing? Your work is great. You got all the stuff with your phone uh, mostly fixed? Wait, wh what was wrong with your phone? I remember you mentioning something about it, but... Fix my phone as well, please! No shower, no nothing, I'm leaving. Your structure in the vicinity of cosplayer is ruined the climbing encore. That was like years ago! Who cares? Nobody cares. And of course, you know. Yeah! So where do you want me to go? Oh, it's... Wait. It's here? Simple as that. Well, that's a ravine, isn't it? That's uh that is a ravine. And here's the gas. Alright. Let's put this one here. Mask. Yeah. Oh it looks so cool! You answered out loud.
You had no service. Oh, I see. Wait, I want that. Give it to me. Put it in the back. Take all of these. So that was the quest? No, I, I, wait, I, I prefer my rope, thank you very much. Now you're getting a new SIM card, oh, I see. Wait, if you're getting a new SIM card, do you get to keep your own phone number or do you, you know, it's mandatory that you have, you change, you get a new one? I don't know how things like that work, my child. I'm old and wrinkly. I'm trying, but I do not know. Too many years since I've used one. Let go. Let go of the rope, Sam. It's not the best idea, like, you know, touching stuff where other people's pee has been Ooh. Oh, everything is the same. That's great. I don't want to have to ask you for your phone number twice, you know. Ooh. Ravine. Pfft. Maybe I should take this off. I love the animation. You Yes. Uh, not this way, that way. They look as if they are in a mint condition and I don't really have to touch them with uh, my spray, but... Yeah, they're fine. It's the only cargo I've ever found laying around that it's in crazy good condition. What do you know? Here, take your stupid garbage. Oh. Oh, I, I, uh, I, w I was gonna keep that for myself. Uh, I, I don't want to give it back to whoever lost it. They shouldn't. They shouldn't lose it in the first place. It's mine now. Preserved. Uncannily, even. Yeah, you're welcome. New interview data acquired. Neanderthals are not extinct. Hartman's theory of evolution and umbilical cords in Devonian or Devonian era fossils. Give me all the stars. Hmm. Volcano orange. No, I'm still Santa. I'm not changing. Thanks for bringing in that lost shipment, Sam. And yes, it did indeed include an ammonite with a bona fide umbilical cord attached. I've already sent some images and a preliminary analysis to Hartman via the network. Interestingly, it seems the surrounding strata contain traces of tar, which lines up with one of his theories. Anyway, I, I know you only just brought this ammonite here, but I'd like you to deliver it to a colleague of mine. An Evo Devo biologist. Lately, she's taken an interest in the tar, and I think she'd be eager to examine this particular specimen. It's quite remarkable, and that's to your credit. To clarify, she has been studying how the tar may have influenced the development of various organisms. Accordingly, I would ask that you also recover the tar collectors deployed near her shelter. 
and deliver them along with the Ammonite. It would be too dangerous for her to attempt to retrieve them herself, which is why we must impose upon you. Of By course. aiding her research, we may yet inch closer to unraveling the secrets of the Death Stranding. We've already made so much progress with the data recovered by the network. With your continued help, I know we can accomplish even more. I completely forgot about her. She's, uh... She's back in the mountain area, isn't she? I can't see her in, uh, unless I accept the Please quest. Delivery terminal for further yeah, yeah. No, I don't want her. Before we do that... Bots. Time sensitive. Foodstuffs. Yes. And yes. Oh, I can take all three of them. Whatever, take them. Deploying autonomous. Oh, I see. Cargo collection from a BT area. Getting harder and harder. I need PCCs. This is this. Um. Uh, no, wait. I already have four, so I don't need any more. Climbing encores. I have four. That should be enough. Um, grenades, let's make three. Am I wearing gloves? No, I need power gloves, not gravity gloves. I will also make, um, perhaps a spare... Power skeleton level three. Wait, what's the difference? The golden one. Yeah. That is a lot of resources used. <laughs> so much junk. No, 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 no. Back. Load everything. And optimize. Have two oxygen masks, with, uh, which I don't need. One of them will go into the private locker. Okay, three PCCs, four PCCs, one climbing encore, one used into the private locker. Okay, quick. Uh, thermal pad, bridges, boots, perfect. I'm at the grenades, four blood bags, power gloves. I. Oof. I'll just wear the new ones instead. Nice. One ladder, the uh, power skeleton. I only have one repair spray. I always need more than one. Uh, yeah, take this. Don't, don't call me. Don't. Keep on keeping up. Weapons restrictions lifted. <clears throat> All right. So, which way? Hmm. I could place like a PCC. No, not PCC. Sorry, a zipline here. But where is the zipline across? I don't see it from here, do I? Ugh, it's so far away! Oh no! God damn it! Oh shit! Fuck me! Fine! I 
I want to place one on top of the the mountain. Can I mark it over there ish? So I can see it on both sides. Nice. Oh, right. Um clear the the, the markers, please. Clear them. <laughs> you got that p p p p p p c c c c. Hey, how dare you? How dare you speak of my p p p p c c c like that? We'll be there in approximately four to five hours. I want a red suit. A uniform. I want to look like Santa. I hate these legs, they're so slow. Well, there's no snowstorm. It's nice and sunny today. What was that? Game, what did you say? Come again? Here, take a like. Yep. Higher. You take a like as well. All right, we're almost there. I could no, no, no. I said I wanted at the top, so both sides can see the zip line. Now the distance is another factor. So if that area is filled with BTs, uh, I want to be able to bail as fast as possible, so I will build another zipline down below. Okay, is this the highest? Can't see the other side just yet. Here should be the highest. Uh, I hate this thing. I'm building it either way, fuck this. No, 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 yeah. Um, it, this one's tricky. Uh, let's place it here. Such bad design. Who built this over there? Construction. Well, yes, um, things have to be constructed before you're able to use them. Construction complete. That's how it works. Is there one down below? I don't think. Well, maybe there is and I cannot see it. <gasps> A free ladder. Why would you look at that? Where does this go? Uh, nowhere in particular. But I can make it go. Please, no! Oh, you motherfucker! Bibi, Bibi, you okay, Bibi? Come on, you can do it. Bibi, Bibi. You okay? Come on! I know how to deal with babies! Calm down! 
Calm down. Stop. Stop crying. Stop it. Stop it. Why can't I hear the baby cry, by the way? Stop it. Shut the fuck up. Stop. Baby. Stop. What do you want from me? What? Come on. Sleep. Who's a good boy? There we go. <laughs> Shake the baby. <laughs> Worry not, I'm a baby expert. Wait, pick, pick what? What? <laughs> oh God. Oh God. <laughs> I will use a shortcut because I'm lazy. <laughs> Is the rope enough? Is it long enough? Yeah. Um, yeah. I could do another one, but do I want to? Nah, it's fine. Can I still see the zipline from here? No. Nope. Not good. Oh wow, what is this place? No, no, no. Wrong. Whoopsie. This one. I have to check my options. I don't know why I can't hear BB at all. Is this normal? Wow. Well, let me see. Um, options. BB. Default device? What does that even mean? Speakers. Maybe... Ugh. Can I hear you now? Because every single time BB freaks out, I have to guess whether he's doing all right or not. Man, this looks so good. Where are we even? Oh, 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 oh. I have no idea where the uh, where the zip line was. Oh no. Right. We got this. I can hear Bibi now! Okay, yeah, it was a... Oh god, look at them, so there's so many! You! You! 
Oh shit, he saw me! You, you... Pick up me! Pumperum! Pumperum! <laughs> you saw nothing! Give me that! Oh god, they're everywhere. I'll just take these and go. Oh, fuck me. And, and now Bibi's doing too much noise. I haven't been playing with Bibi noises for the whole game. looking for me oh, oh I missed it shit let's go baby crap there's another one pick this up uh, um, pick, pick it up. Where, where is it? Stop playing games with me. I don't see him. <sighs> this place is insane. Okay, got it. I see you. Collect all four containers of tar extraction devices. There are four of them? Where's the rest of them? Oh, one is over there. The other is here. Let's go, Lou. If I did a fight here, it would end up being like half the time used. Where? Where is it? It would take me half the time to get rid of them. But where's the fun in that? Okay, one more over there. Well, we can still fight them. I'm kind of enjoying the stealth element in the game. Just one up front. Got you, baby. Ugh. They are endless. How do I get there? Hmm. Yes. Okay, got everything. Wait, that was not the one? No, I, I need tar some... 
Sam, Sam, please! Pick it up. Okay, got it. Where's my ladder? Easy now. Good! I'm going the same way I came in. Does that mean this area doesn't have BTs anymore because we cleared them up? Or do they respawn? Doesn't seem like it. Yeah, I feel you. Pretty is quiet. up front wait easy oh. I can't cap this one Shh. where did it go no Got him. Okay, let's keep going. I want to get out of here. Oh, oh, I missed it. Is this the... Oh no, I'm going the wrong... No, I'm not going the wrong way. I'm not going the right way either. Cargo container ruined. The oxygen mask. Yeah, I just made that. Nice. Let's run for science. Okay. Can I get a moment? Like, um, not spray. Uh, what was the one thing I wanted to do? I forgot. All right. Drink some energy. Thing. Crap. Poop. Put the repair spray back. Oh, I see it. Okay, this is the one we built. I could. Container damaged. Wait, are you. What? No. No, 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 no. I need those. Do not. Please do not damage them. No. No chiral network cover. Great. Just my luck. We're so close! My, I'm running out of batteries! Why does it have to be that way? I 
I'm telling you, uh, Santa is having the time of his life. Can I spray them now? Yes! Oh my god, so much better. We did it. you guys lived in a very happy little town all together instead of just you know one here one there one in the side of the on the mountain the other guy the sound of the other mountain ah! I'm not using any weapons I'm naked Wait, what's this? Too close. Don't mind me, I was looking for collectibles. Safe and secure. You do not disappoint, my friend. 1% damage? Unacceptable. Unacceptable. Now, connect me to the Chiral Network. That's where my studies will truly begin. A grenade launcher, you say? Tell me more. New interview data acquired. Interview with the Evo Devo biologist. Tar bubbles up from the beach. Hmm. There are two parts in the map that I haven't really visited yet, or nobody really sent me to them. Oh, on the east side of the map. Hmm. Huh. I have to take a look later on, maybe off stream. Thank you. It goes without saying, but I am convinced that the tar is related to the BTs and the Death Stranding. After all, both it and Timefall are the defining features of the post stranding ecosystem. Sudden environmental changes such as these invariably lead to the extinction of organisms that fail to adapt. Those that do adapt do so by virtue of enhancers, the regions of DNA that grant successful organisms their advantages. These genetic factors are the key to evolution, but there are genes which have the opposite effect, those which disadvantage organisms. Extinction factors, as they have been called. These are the seeds of advancement and obsolescence. Such factors may lie dormant within us all, a choice waiting to be made for every being since the advent of life itself. If so, then ancient proof may hide deep within the tar, evidence of these genetic decisions that may aid us in navigating our current crossroads. In any event, thanks to you, 
I can now study the composition of the tar in greater detail. I'll make sure to share any interesting results with you later. Well done, Sam. You furthered our research into the Death Stranding in ways you cannot imagine. Thank you again for bringing me Mama's body, as well as that Ammonite. Speaking of which, my analysis of its umbilical cord is proceeding apace. I've been comparing the data against some of our restored archives. Anyway, would you mind returning to my lab? Preparations are finally complete for the chiral relay integration. If you could collect the necessary materials for the restoration work and bring them here, I would be most grateful. Lady, I'm exhausted from the trip. You could have at least served me some hot tea or hot cocoa or... Uh, instead of talking to me about ammonites and the like. Oh, wait. My heater is not working? <sighs> I want all that same. Okay. Live fish. Time sensitivo. Take it. All of these. My bots. The army bot. of bots is ready to deploy. All right. This is gonna. This is where I'm gonna wrap it up for the day. I really need to make some dinner. I didn't have anything all day today, and I'm freaking starving. Also, what's that huge thing on top of my? What is that? I can't read what it says. All right. Uh, I'll be streaming again tomorrow. I hope, because I really want to wrap it up. We're. It feels like I'm extremely close to the end. Then again, I, I don't know. But it feels like most of the map is done. And there's this one point in the far western part of the map where we haven't really discovered just yet. But we're really, really, really close. Love you too, Jimmy. I'll see you all tomorrow then. Have fun whatever you do. Have an amazing afternoon or evening, depending on where you are. Uh, enjoy the rest of your Monday? Question mark? Is it Monday already? Yeah, I think it's Monday. And I'll see you all again tomorrow. And don't forget, stay tuned and keep on gaming. Bye-bye. I don't know where to park Sam for this. Uh, this is not the best place to leave Sam. Oh, right. Right, right. Let me check real quick if we can raid someone. Is anybody available for raid? Uh, I, I guess not. Well, <laughs> thank you for the beaties. I will see you guys. Thank you. Thanks for again. The stream. No, thank you for uh, for being part of it and for the support and for all the beaties. Have fun whatever you do. I'll see you later. Bye-bye.